going to make no memory on your system. Yep. I wouldn't check mine. I, I saw it about 100 gigs, but yeah, mine was getting pretty full cool too. I just deleted a few games that I'm not going to be playing again. Yeah, I found out the PS4, like, it may have a lot of memory, but with, like, what... It needs it. It needs the, the more. Ga the games take so much. But the thing is, you don't have to delete your game saves, like, your files. Just to the delete game the game data. data. It's like a game you're not going to play very often. You, if you don't mind loading them, because they don't take that long to download. For the most part. Like, I, I'll never delete, um... My MLB one be until I get a new MLB game because that one took forever. Because guess how they made that one? They have to individually load every team and every player. Ew. Like I actually while I was waiting for it to load because you couldn't access um like a franchise mode or anything until it finished loading the entire game. But you could do play now, like just a quick scrimmage game, right? Mm -hmm. Well, I opened it up and I'm like you know rather than try to go through, I figure well the two base people, the Yankees and I think it was. I don't know the other team, but those are the two that always pop up when you play now. I'm like, I'll just use them because I'm sure they're already finished loading. I had like half of the Yankees were loaded. Like, not even the entire team, just like five of their players were loaded. I'm like, y you fucking kidding me? What? You load each individual character separately? Why? Oh uh, yeah, there's a chest here whenever you start the game, and then where I was trying to jump in and go, the there was a chest when I was playing Warlock. Bad news. Apparently there's not it's one already in full hands. But yeah, I, I've, see, Antonio here's been playing this for this week. I've been playing Madden for however long, and I'm getting back into Pokemon. That's what, like, I think that's one thing. Is I, 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 I don't know, do you actually have this perk where occasionally you just decide you want to go back to Pokemon for a while? Yeah, but the thing is, like, five minutes later, because all I really literally have nothing to do but just fucking breed home edges until I get the run when I get sick. Well, well see, that's down. why I like that I have both, both games. I can literally just keep one of them as... Like, where I'm constantly go back and maybe try to catch a few new Pokemon or breed things. In the walls. And I can always start the other one over. Right, that's what I have. That's what I do with X. I start that one over if I feel like. I start X over as well because I like Xerneas better than this But let's be honest. Of the legendaries in this gen, it's Xerneas' series this time. If you, th if you think about battle. it, if you think about it, each Pokemon, or each series, really has that one Pokemon that they're kind of overarching legendary, right? Like red and blue, it was Mewtwo. Sure, you had legendary birds and Mew, but your goal in the game was kind of to get there and catch Mewtwo. Well, the thing is, Mewtwo was in both games. Yeah. Whereas... But then, but I mean, there, I guess Gen 2 wasn't quite that way, but it felt like that to me because... You really had no choice in the matter on that one. Well, you can only get one of the two main legendaries at a time, and Celebi was ungettable in America. Yeah, they had an event in Japan, but they never did it in America. Up until Pokebank came out, which I'm very happy about. Yeah, I've got it. So I, for, I actually, I, I blanked so much that when I was looking through my Pokebank, I'm like, how the fuck did I get a Celebi? I, it took me like three or four days of thinking about it. I'm like, oh, that's right. But seriously, give me- I want a big teeny. I had a big teeny, but that was like when I actually got the big teeny. I bought a- I bought a fucking black too that had Meloetta previously loaded in it. Yeah. But around that time, I was fucking horrible with Pokemon games. Like, I played them, get to the point- because I never had anyone to play them with. I just got fucking sick of having them and doing nothing with them. Yeah. I turned both of them back in. Lost big teeny, lost the Meloetta I fucking had. Yeah. So, I mean, I feel stupid for turning that shit in. But, I mean, like I said, I never had anyone to actually play it with. Because I'd always be doing other things. I got sick of just them sitting there with like not being able to do anything with them. I will tell you, one of the coolest legendaries in in a specific game was a uh, Giratina and Heart Gold Soul Silver. Because put them out as your lead, you just got this massive death dragon walking behind you. Oh yeah. And it, but he doesn't walk around inside. It's only when you're outside he walks around. You just killed an. But that's just cool. I mean, you can have Lugia too. This could but Giratina is fucking Giratina. Need to go see the speaker. See, I'm hoping that when uh, Ruby and Sapphire come out, they sure as hell better give us a way to get Rayquaza. I'm sure they will. It'd be fucking like in all. If, if I can't get Rayquaza, I don't even want to play the games. Red, Ruby and oh, Ruby and Sapphire had a way to get at Rayquaza. I thought you couldn't get him until Emerald. No, you can get him in Ruby and Sapphire. You can, okay. It's just Emerald has more use. And of course, for Ruby and Ruby and Sapphire 
Kyogre and Groudon. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's that's also where they have the uh, legendary golems, right? Like Reggie Ice, Reggie Steel, and yeah, Reggie Rock. Now, I, well, Reggie Gigas is Gen Four. I didn't know that. Yeah. And he Always. sucks. Reggie Gigas is the worst legendary. Yeah. By a not design wise, he looks cool as hell. But as far as his stats and the his problem ability, is, like, have you seen his fucking ability? The fucking slow start pisses me off. But the thing is, once he gets going. He still doesn't do as much as he looked like he should be well, doing. Well, if he gets going and you've trained him and leveled him well, he can do a lot of damage, but... The problem is it takes three turns. Five. Five turns. Five. Oh, so yeah. So start is five fucking turns. And guess what? You're going to lose him in five fucking turns. I mean, he may be Unless you're fighting a, few... a level two Pidgey, you're going to lose him in five turns. Yep. And when you catch him, don't you catch him at, like, level one anyway? Um... I think so. There was a right. time. Or level 40, I don't remember. When we were I think, honestly, the powerful. only non-X and Y legendary I have right now... But that was long ago. In X and Y, I have Celebi because it came in Pokemon. Bank, Until it wakes Fionn. and finds its voice. Fionn. I got Wonder Trader Fionn. Damn it! I, I, will, one. I, I need to get my Pokemon my Ranger again so I can get fucking Manaphy. You, you must have no end of questions. He got a level 100 Zephyr. What? My friend got a level in its dying breath. And wonder trade. The traveler what? created. Yeah. What? Ghost. I do need to get Pokemon Ranger open. I'm pretty sure it's in game that you can get the Manaphy. Do they even, are they, are they, do they even sell that anymore? You can probably get a game to stop, but are those even connected anymore? And do what the Shit, that's right, they cut off the DS a long time ago. A couple years ago, didn't they? What I think, but I mean, it? damn it. Wait! If you plug it into the 3DS, but I'm saying, can you connect the game? Centuries ago, Fuck, I don't know. You'd need, you would need a DS oh, and 3DS. I mean, you'd crippled. need two devices. Oh, I've got two devices. I could Didn't you get a 2DS? Power no, I haven't gotten one yet. Uh, you said I have my DS. I was going to this summer, but then I something else happened and I didn't get it. To uh, but I want them to release a game. Lately, those I don't care if it's Pokemon Z or Red, no. Ruby and Sapphire or whatever. Where it's actually it's capable, you're enemy. actually able to catch all the Pokemon. Yeah. Legendaries the included. Is coming back. Like, see, I, 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 I think, if I remember correctly, didn't time. Gen 3 originally give you an opportunity where you could catch, like, the they had where you could catch Mew, you could even catch what can Deoxys. I do? Dude, I'm fucking pissed off because I, I really back wanted Deoxys, but because I never had a way of learning Guardians any of that shit was going on. I never got Deoxys, never got Jirachi. I didn't even yeah. know about that shit until well, after the fact. I wasn't playing the game during that. Not really. No, that's what, I know. But well, the thing is, I, there's got to be a way to get Deoxys. I'm assuming they just want you to, you know, forward it in, because the stones that change its forms sure. are in the fossil lab. We're in this together now. Right. And in the fossil lab, you've got somebody asking about Genesect, so can I get Genesect somewhere? Apparently only if I got it in black and white when I did the, release, the event. Problem is, I never kept up with that, nor did I have the games at the time. Like, I freaking got rid of Black 2 literally right before Genesect came out. Yeah. They just need to find a way to make it where you can actually get a little... All of the Pokemon. Mm-hmm. You, you, I, right now, do you want to know the the, lawn, the non-legendary I've had the hardest time getting for black and white? I mean, for X. Hmm. Rattata. Hmm. I have not been able to find somebody who's willing to trade a Rattata without getting a legendary. I'm like, I'm not going to fucking trade you Okay, Zernius. I will give you a Rattata. Chill out, you already got I think one, you finally you? did. I think that's what it was. Like, it oh, took, yeah, I did give you one. It just took me forever to do that. And that's insane. Rattata should not be hard to catch. <laughs> I will say, I've thought about it, and if I really think about it, you know like you know how in every Pokemon game, obviously you get your starter first, but usually within like that first route, there's the bird and there's the rodent. You know what I'm talking about? Every game, like Pidgey, Rattata, Hoot Hoot, and Centret, Bidoof, and whatever the bird was for Gen 3, I can't remember his name. Wait, uh... Was that was that was that Taylo? No, Taylo was four, wasn't he? Taylo was four. Wait, who came out with Taylo? No one came out with Taylo. Did it? No, because there's always one. Because then there was Z Zigzagoon and Zigzagoon. No, Taylo was three. Taylo and Zigzagoon. No, Taylo and Z Zigzagoon were Ruby and Sapphire. Oh, that's right. And then Bidoof, Bidoof was, was the, right. Bidoof and Starly. Starly, and then Gen Five had um, Bidoof. No, no, not Bidoof. You said Bidoof. Bidoof. 
not the Pidove. Pidove. Right, and Pidove. Who was, who was the rodent for that? For, uh, it's the raccoon with the freaky eyes. The one that became Pat, the Pat Rat. And then you got Bunnelby and Fletchinger. I think it's hilarious. If you really look at the, the, the rodents, have gotten worse. <laughs> they have. Because Rotata, for all of his jokes, he was pretty good. Can wreck. Eradicate yeah. is fast, and you give it hyperfang, shit can wreck. Yeah. Centret was a pretty decent, and he was cute. Yeah. Fur it was adorable. Fur it was pretty cute. I personally would maybe switch three and four because I, I hate away. I like Bidoof. And the barrel is a badass HM slave. Yeah. You, this guy here can attest in X and Y I have like a level 80 b- barrel that I took to the Elite Four and won with <laughs> yes he yeah. was I didn't actually because I, I, I screwed up and I lost my Gyarados to ironically the water Elite Four guy somehow I don't know how that happened because <laughs> I threw him out there to take double hits while I healed my Pikachu I had a Pikachu in Elite Four because I couldn't find the Thunderstone <laughs> but um I just had to heal him because um, there are one of the, his Pokemon did, like, the did something did a lot of damage. I'm thinking, you know, Gyarados is going to there. He's not weak to water, so or he's going to he can take a hit. No, his defense is ass. To look into it. But he was like ten levels higher. Yeah. And a water move's not super effective, so I figured he could take a hit. Mm-hmm. Well, they knocked him out, and of course, dumbass me didn't have any revives. Like I bought potions and everything else, but I forgot revives. <laughs> um, so I, I didn't have him going to the fire gym. So I'm like, crap. What am I going to do? And this okay. happened to be the, 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 the worst part the about this happened to be the um, time that and I ran through the game surrounded by fallen. and well, did not I'm get a water storm, are. so I didn't get Squirtle or um, Froakie. I think that was actually the gen that I had. I had um, Blaziken and Chespin, yep. and I I had uh, no, I had Finnegan, Blaziken, and I picked um, what's his name? Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur. Because I wanted a status effect Pokemon to catch, like something to put people to sleep with. Mm-hmm. Um, so I didn't have any other water. I'm like, okay, well, obviously I can't you know, send Bulbasaur out against the Fire Elite Four member. The collapse. Uh, unless I want him to die. Boarding the colony ships. Um, off to build cities beyond. I, like, I guess I'm just gonna have to throw. I never made that before when I was double jumping. Like, I'm. Pro- I guess I'm gonna have to throw Blaziken out there and just hope that I can win the, the War of Attrition. And then also, I was like, hey, wait. The barrel's part water, the hill, and it has surf and waterfall. That's the sky. Let me just take a chance. So I threw a barrel out there, and he swept Malva. I'm just didn't take damage. At I gotta all. say, she's surprisingly easy to take out. Though. If you have something that affects, it. the only issue you'd possibly have is Brave Bird. But that's only because that thing is so damn fast it lets it off, but it's pretty weak. Apparently, the barrel's faster. <laughs> I'm not even joking. The barrel surf dead, and I think I was, the barrel is one like two or three levels higher than them. Well, his special defense is pretty weak. Not the barrel, but the, the yeah, flame the bird. bird. Um, yeah. Obviously, for me, because I always had Blaziken. I either had Blaziken and Delphox, or I had Charizard and Delphox. So the steel guy was never a problem for me ever. Even the hardest you. one, the hardest one actually was like Oak Pass because he has the rock typing. Right. But even that wasn't that bad. Honestly, And he had sturdy. Fuck sturdy. All you gotta do is literally just. Actually, he is weak to fire. He is weak to fire, but he's got sturdy, so I'd always try to one hit him, and then he'd get hyper potion, so it'd take, three, it'd take four attacks to finally kill him. Because he'd run out of healing items. That's, all, that's always been my strategy. Yeah. Who's the other one? Oh, the dragon. The dragon was easy.